it's that time again, my darling subjects. Although this story is a little different from the others we've told, allow me to weave you a tale. This is death. It was a dark and stormy night. A young woman was in her home sitting on the couch reading a book. As she read, she did not realize the upcoming visit of a, of a midnight visitor. This visitor was not who she wanted to see, but he came anyway. A knock came to the door. The woman looked confusedly at the door, as if wondering who it could be. Another knock, but louder and more determined to be answered, as the woman stood up and walked toward the door. Then suddenly, she stopped. Fear crept into her body like a spider crawling on its web ever so slowly toward its prey that had been caught in the sticky strings. She didn't dare move as another knock came to the door. The storm outside became more furious as rain pounded on the roof as if it were ice itself. The wind blew stronger, making the trees scratch the windows, lightning flashing in the dark sky, and thunder so loud it couldn't be compared to the loud sound of a woman's beating heart in her ears. The next thing the woman knew, the storm knocked out power, leaving her all alone in the dark with her midnight visitor just behind her door. No more knocking came to the door. Instead, the knob began to slowly turn until the door opened by itself. The door was only slightly open, but not open enough to reveal its unwanted guest. Despite the woman's fear, she slowly walked toward the door. Step by step, she approached the door, reaching with a shaky hand. She grabbed the knob and paused. Her heartbeat increased rapidly. Her whole body shook, and her eyes held fear in their depths as she quickly opened the door. Standing in front of her was her worst nightmare. She screamed in horror as she ran away from her date with destiny. She ran to the safety of her room after climbing a flight of stairs just to reach it, but all too suddenly as her foot slipped in the last step, it appeared right in front of her. Taken by surprise, the young woman lost her footing and began to fall backwards. She screamed once more before the cracking sound of her head opening as she hit the sharp side of the steps, shutting her up. As she continued to fall, more sounds of bone cracking, snapping, and bending made her body more breakable as she finally hit the floor with a loud thump. Her body no longer moved. Her blood spilled out of her head like a fountain forming a pool. Her unwanted guest stood next to her, watching her bleed. His hooded cloak covered his entire body, while the hood covered his skinless face, as well as his bony sockets, as he shook his head at the poor dead girl. Holding his side closely, he sliced the girl's head clean off, as he did with everybody that died miserably. The young woman's unwanted guest was death, and it was knocking on her door, telling her that her time had come. So, will death be knocking at your door, and will you answer it, or will you not? You cannot escape death, for death will certainly find you. Well then, that was certainly spooky. Not to even mention that it was written by a friend of mine. Thank you, Luna-chan. I enjoyed your story. That said, however, if you would like to leave your own stories for me to read for this month, do leave them in the comments below. That said, however, there are more tales to be told. Stay tuned, my darling subjects. <laughs>